Well, uh, Governor Ron DeSantis from Florida is making news again, and uh, we're going to talk about that right now. Ed Battagliano, Walker Wildman, Tim Wildman. What's the governor doing now, Walker? Well, uh, the federal government, uh, under the Biden administration, they've been uh, busing and flying uh, illegal immigrants that are apprehended at the southern border. They've been flying them into Jacksonville, Florida, and other major airports in Florida, and literally just dropping them off in, in different cities, uh, thousands of illegal immigrants. So Ron DeSantis has said, as governor of Florida, that he's had enough of that, and he's proposing in the 2022 state government budget $8 million to provide transportation for the illegals that are brought to Florida to take them to Delaware, where President Biden is from. Delaware and Martha's Vineyard. Yeah. Why Martha's Vineyard, Ed? Well, Martha's Vineyard is a, <laughs> uh, a famous... Yeah, grew uh, up in the Boston area. <laughs> uh, kind of a playground for the uh, rich of New England and the whole eastern seaboard. And so, you know, Ron DeSantis, uh, he really is... I, I don't know whether he's going to run for president, but right. if he is, he's building his street credibility amongst conservatives. Mm -hmm. This move right here, I have no idea whether that's right. constitutional, whether that's legal, whether he can just pick mm -hmm. people up who the administration has said are here in a sense legally and then cart them somewhere else but it's trumpian okay and yeah, by that i yeah, mean like yeah. when president when it's candidate bold. trump yeah when pre uh, candidate trump was running for president and he said i'm going to I'm going to build the wall right, right, and he's right, going right. to build that wall that just caught people's imagination right. And uh, it never got completely done, but people right. liked the idea of bold right. decision making. And that's what Ron DeSantis has been doing. I think he really is becoming kind of a rock star amongst conservatives. Yeah. And that's the kind of bold, and he's a governor. Yeah. So you had someone like candidate Trump who was a businessman. This is a governor. I think that appeals to people who see the dysfunction in Washington. Personally, I think the Democrats are more worried about Governor DeSantis in 2024 than they are about Donald Trump, the former president, but that's just my opinion. Anyway, we'll see what happens with this, but we appreciate you joining us today on Reason & Company.